All right, now one of the things I wanna talk about real quick is why it makes little to no sense to overtrain on purpose in an attempt to get a rebound in size and strength. Now, first off, muscle mass doesn't super compensate like I explained in the last video. And secondly, when you overtrain, performance will suffer due to the excess cortisol that comes from overtraining. So I'll explain this real quick. Cortisol increases adrenaline by way of increasing the enzyme responsible for converting noradrenaline into adrenaline, which can make the adrenergic receptors resistant, which means that your response to adrenaline gradually becomes weaker. What that means is that the neurological factors involved in force production, like recruitment, firing rate, intra and intermuscular coordination are all affected, which means your strength, speed, and coordination are all affected. Then what happens when you take time off is the stress being placed on the body is reduced, which means cortisol is reduced, which means adrenaline is reduced, which allows the receptors to regain sensitivity back to where it would have been. And as a result, performance appears to improve, which makes you think that what you did worked when really all you did was beat yourself so far into the ground that by contrast, getting back to where you would have been seems like you made a lot of progress.